For Trinidad Cervantes, graduating from high school was a big deal, and getting Canyon View High School in Cedar City to allow her to wear a Native American symbol during the ceremony had deep meaning. But when she got to commencement and her big moment, that's not how things turned out. Fox 13 Spencer Joseph reports on what happened. I just don't want anybody else to have to go through this. Seeing my daughter um, walk without her cap was, it was kind of heartbreaking. For the Cervantes family, Monday morning was supposed to be joyous with their daughter Trinidad graduating. A student with great grades and a varsity basketball player, she too was excited to be graduating. We were getting ready to go and one of the teachers called me over and said you can't have your cap decorated. Trinidad was confused. She had put beads on her cap as well as an eagle feather to symbolize her Native American heritage, which a few weeks before her aunt had gotten approved by the school. I was just frustrated and like happy to get it over with. Glad that I didn't have to go back to the school ever again. Canyon View High School in Cedar City announced their rules for graduation. They do say specifically that caps can't be decorated. But upon reading these rules, they say her aunt went to the school to see if the beating and feather could be used to honor her Native American heritage. Would you have done this had the principal not said, yeah, go ahead? No, we wouldn't have done it. We would have abided by the rules. This is the live stream of the graduation. You can see faculty members talking about the cap with Trinidad in the background. Then moments later, you see her walking out without it on. This is the cap itself, decorated with Native American beans and an eagle feather. The eagle is a winged symbol for the Native American people because it is seen as the strongest and bravest of all birds that was given to my niece. For so for this family, their hope is by sharing this uncomfortable experience that the school and district will recognize the symbolism of these designs and also make sure that a situation like this doesn't happen again. I'm hoping that they will pass a law like they did in other states so that as Native Americans, we could be able to um, have our caps beaded and show our heritage and be proud. Spencer Joseph, Fox 13 News, Utah. Hmm. We just heard back from the Iron County School District about this case. They say the district doesn't have a policy on graduation attire and instead leave it up to individual schools and administrators. They say Cedar and Canyon View High Schools prohibit decorating the top of those mortar board caps, but a wide variety of those can be worn to reflect cultural traditions and individuality.